What does it mean when you dream red? You are passionate and sensitive. You put a lot of energy into your emotional relationships, and you are dedicated to getting the most out of them. If you dreamed of the color red last night, this could be what your dream meant. If your whole dream has a red hue about it, it could be a general indication of your true nature. It points to the quality and types of relationships you have and the kind of energy you put into them. But the color red has other meanings in dreams, too. Red is often considered the color or anger and war and dreaming of it might be a warning from your subconscious to keep your cool in hot situations. Don't yell at the toll booth attendant if the line is slow. Keep your temper under control when your three-year-old insists on getting herself dressed, even if you're 15 minutes late. Dreaming of a deep, blood red usually means that good news is coming your way. Perhaps you are waiting to hear about a promotion, acceptance into a good school or even the closing on your new house. Dreaming of this color can be an indicator that good things are coming your way. Red is also the color of passion, and if your dream is a passionate one with lots of red in it, it is important to get the entire dream analyzed, each significant object in your dream can have meaning, along with who is in the dream, and what is said or done. Why are dreams hard to remember? Researchers estimate that 5 minutes after a dream, people have forgotten 50% of its content, increasing to 90% another 5 minutes later. Most dreams are entirely forgotten by the time someone wakes up. It is not known precisely why dreams are so hard to remember. However, there are several steps that people can take to improve their dream recall. These include Waking up naturally and not with an alarm Focusing on the dream as much as possible upon waking Writing down as much about the dream as possible upon waking Making recording dreams a routine Why do we dream? There are several hypotheses and concepts as to why we dream. Are dreams merely part of the sleep cycle or do they serve some other purpose? Possible explanations for why we dream include To represent unconscious desires and wishes To interpret random signals from the brain and body during sleep To consolidate and process information gathered during the day To work as a form of psychotherapy from converging evidence and new research methodologies, researchers have speculated that dreaming is offline memory reprocessing, consolidates learning and memory tasks, is a subsystem of the waking default network, which is active during mind-wandering and daydreaming. Dreaming could be seen as cognitive simulation of real-life experiences participates in the development of cognitive capabilities is psychoanalytic dreams are highly meaningful reflections of unconscious mental functioning is a unique state of consciousness that incorporates three temporal dimensions experience of the present processing of the past and preparation for the future provides a psychological space where overwhelming contradictory or highly complex notions can be brought together by the dreaming ego that would be unsettling while awake this process serves the need for psychological balance and equilibrium as with many things concerning the brain and unconscious thought there is so much that remains unknown about dreaming dreams are difficult to study in a laboratory as technology and new research techniques are developed, the understanding of dreams will continue to grow. Dream interpretation is the process of assigning meaning to dreams. In many ancient societies, such as those of Egypt and Greece, 
dreaming was considered a supernatural communication or a means of divine intervention, whose message could be interpreted by people with these associated spiritual powers. In modern times, various schools of psychology and neurobiology have offered theories about the meaning and purpose of dreams. Most people currently appear to interpret dream content according to the Freudian theory of dreams in countries, as found by a study conducted in the United States, India, and South Korea. People appear to believe dreams are particularly meaningful, they assign more meaning to dreams than to similar waking thoughts. For example, people report they would be more likely to cancel a trip they had planned that involved a plane flight if they dreamt of their plane crashing the night before than if they thought of their plane crashing the night before or the Department of Homeland Security issued a federal warning. However, people do not attribute equal importance to all dreams. People appear to use motivated reasoning when interpreting their dreams. They are more likely to view dreams confirming their waking beliefs and desires to be more meaningful than dreams that contradict their waking beliefs and desires. Thank you.